Well, what's up YouTube? Drift Hunter here with this week's garage sale finds. I was pretty busy last week. I had um, finals and stuff like that, so sorry I didn't put anything out. And this one's going to be quick too because I got to put all this stuff away because we're having people over. But this is what I found. We'll take a look at some of this stuff. Um, I bought some of these carnival glass pieces. Um, I don't really like buying carnival glass. Um, the guy had about five pieces or something. I bought them all for 17. Um, there's two more in the garage, but they're kind of junky. Um, I don't really like buying this stuff because it's just impossible to ship, but um, that's got the, the little Fenton tag on it. Let's see. That looks so having the tag um, is going to help that out a lot as far as being able to sell it, but this stuff's pretty low quality. Um, there's a lot of imperfections in the glass, um, so it's just a pain because you can have the stuff sent back a lot. I've had a lot of glass sent back. Um, so here is... A little Fenton. Um, this one I think is worth the most. This is the only one I wanted, uh, but the guys had, you know, he was selling all of it as a group. Um, this one's from like 2009. Um, this one I think I can get 40, 35, 40 bucks for. Um, here's another little piece. Again, it's got the, this one's new. Price tags, 45 bucks. Um, but this also has the Fenton sticker in it, Fenton logo in there. But if you look, you can see it's got like this split right here. That's a mold line. Like that's from the casting because it's got all along this edge, like there's another little spot right there. With just a little divot in it. So this stuff's like, like this is brand new. It shouldn't have a split in it like that. So I don't know if I can get anything for this one, um, or if you know, I'm I'm almost positive that that's part of the production. It's like super smooth and it's not like a crack. And there's a bunch of them. There's like one there. There's like another one. So I don't know. This one might be worth a little bit of money. I might be able to sell it, but, you know, someone might return it because they're like, oh, it's cracked, but, you know, it's just a little flaw. This stuff was cheap quality anyway, but whatever. Anyway, enough with the carnival glass. Um, I bought this little vase. I have no idea uh, who made it. Um, I guess I'll get the jewelry out of the way. This nice... Um, double strand, it's got that kind of liquid silver uh, type stuff that I see all the time. It's marked on the clasp, and it's got uh, some designer name on there, Sterling. Mark Sterling, too, so that was a, like 50 cents or something. Pretty nice necklace. Um, this ring, sorry, the, the lighting's pretty bad in here today. Um, this ring, you can see it's marked 925 on the inside in Mexico. Um, trying to copy that uh, Cartier or Cartier style with the little brass screws in it, whatever. Um, this double strand necklace, pearls, or like fake pearls. Um, that's marked Pompadour Silver on the back. It's like a 1950s. Um, cultured pearl necklace for 50 cents. Um, this really uh, long chain, silver chain, silver little um, heart pendant. That was a dollar. Uh, some single earrings. You can see some nice single earrings. This is just a plated ring. Um, some little silver hoops and a little silver ring. Um, this elephant, 
I was hoping it was silver. I think it's brass. Um, and the, the reason why I think that is like silver, you would be able to uh, dent it. If this was hollow silver, it, you would be able to dent this most likely. Um, so it's probably brass, but it's kind of a nice little pendant. Um, sterling silver weighted candlestick. I don't even know how many of these I have, like six or seven. And that was 50 cents. Um, this is a Gruen quartz watch. It's got the uh, the angled, like the beveled uh, glass, and it's a really so these watches aren't expensive. Maybe maybe twenty dollars or something I can get for it. Um. So so I got this Game Boy Color, purple, it's got some initials scratched into it, game, uh, bug life, whoop de doo I don't know, I just hold on to this until I get like three or four of them, put them in a lot, and I'll get like 40 or 50 bucks for the lot. Um, let's see, I got these, you've probably seen these already in the video but these are sterling silver picture frames Let's see if I can it's kinda hard to see them but you can see the little lion and it's marked RC which is um, cars of Sheffield Sheffield I don't know C-A-R-R-S cars and I guess they're known for making nice picture frames so I paid uh, 15 bucks for the two of these. Um, probably 30 a piece, 40 a piece if I'm lucky. And last here is this uh, PlayStation, which, you know, I wish it was a Nintendo or something, obviously, but um, this came with in the original box. It's uh, pretty good condition, the box. Uh, it's not perfect, but I think it's displayable. Anyways, this is a brand new PlayStation. Uh, the, the first one, obviously. Here is the manual with the demo disc and everything. This is sealed. This um, inner thing is, is completely sealed still. Um, I've got the old adapter and a just like perfectly mint controller. Uh, power cord. I guess I'm missing the the AV cord. The this cord. Um, I might have one of those. If not, I, I can find one, I'm sure. Um, I see those all over the place. So I got this PlayStation here. Uh, you can see that it's pretty much hasn't been messed with. Uh, it's, it's brand new. I don't think it's really been out of this. Um, considering this is sealed, we've got the box. Uh, the box is in pretty good shape. You can see all the old games on the back. Parappa the Rappa. You know what's up. Colony Wars 1. Blasto. I never even played like any of these. Oh, Armored Core. I remember that. Star Wars. Tomb Raider. That was a good one. So, uh, box is pretty nice. Everything else is mint. Uh, sealed instructions and manual and everything. That's, like, really nice. So, you know, it's just a PlayStation 1. No one really plays these that much anymore. But, I don't know, 40 or 50 bucks, probably. Because it's really nice, really clean. Please be sure to like my videos if you like them. Give me a thumbs up.
leave a comment and please subscribe to my videos. Thanks for watching.